going on guys we're back again with another video we're gonna be fixing the stripped threads on a cv axle of a honda element 2005 honda element if you like these videos hit the like button subscribe and enjoy the video what i did was i put the nut on backwards and start hitting the nut but it was just jamming it up on there and it just got so nasty so instead of replacing the axle we just bought a kit we're gonna fix it okay so let's just check out our kit here i'll put this in the description where i got it found this little kit all right what you want to know about the kit is i went ahead and got a new uh, spindle lock nut for my axle and whatever it is for your vehicle you just look on the back and it'll say thread size mine says m24-1.50 okay it also has the hex size for the socket you need but this is the size you need for your die set the M24-1.50. Whatever it is for your car, look on the back. You'll see the thread size. So, on this kit, this is a die set. Twist axle spindle rethreading tool set. So, what we do is we go in here. We are going to look for M24-1.50. Which that is this one right here. This is the one we're going to use. Okay, so I got my, my die kit uh m24 1.50 okay there it is so i'm gonna try to put this on here i went ahead and got me my, my 32 to give me a little thrust if i if i have trouble so let's let's give it a try Now that we have it on there, <clears throat> it's on there. Okay, I'm gonna try to wrap this around here. I need to hold it somehow. <clears throat> Still wants to turn. Got a hole one side. Turn this thing. We're on there. Gonna spray it with a little WD-40. Making some progress. Let's check out our work so far. How we did with cleaning these up. Could it be that we got nice threads now? We'll find out. This is the um, spindle lock nut that we got. And this is how we found our die numbers off the back. Let's give it a shot. Fix that. Guys, if you like these videos, please hit the like button, subscribe, save some money, get you out of a bind with these little videos. So let me know what you think. And that's that. Okay.